Okay, so Capricorn, you guys came out, so let me do you guys, which is better for me. Let me write this. I should have wrote this already off camera, but Capricorns, um, really quickly, I'm not going to say the full thing. Just please remember, as I hop into the reading, the flip-flop the roles according to your situation. You be your own leader of discernment when it comes to this reading. You pick and choose what fits and what does not fit, all right? If part of the reading does not resonate to your liking, please leave it for whoever it does resonate with. Remember, it is not a personal reading. It is a general reading, so please do not take it personal. Once again, take what fits, leave the rest. I could be saying you, it could be them, I could be saying he, it could be a she, okay? Just keep an open mind. Somebody's trying to explain themselves on one half. One half, somebody's like, you don't know my struggle, you don't know what I went through. <sighs> this is why I did what I did. Or you don't know me as you as good as you think I am. Uh, I, you don't know me as well as you think you do. Okay, I don't know what I just said, but please excuse my language, my language, my speech. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Scorpio or half Scorpio in your chart, but there may be some secrets that comes out about this Scorpio or how people, somebody is handling a situation. Something sexually. What is this? There's some hidden tension when it comes to... Why am I? Well, I picked it up, so let me just use this first. Time spent wearing is time spent. Time. So somebody is focused on all the time that they spent. They could be worrying about a situation again, trying to plead their case and why they did what they did. You don't know my struggle. You don't know what I went through. Breathe. Somebody needs to breathe. Take some time out. It is safe to wait. Somebody could have been trying to rush a situation, trying to get something done. But take your time. What's really going on, my Capricorns? Somebody could be trying to get out of a situation as well too talk to god sometimes aquarius just had this um gaslighting pretty much so who's gaslighting a situation okay someone is acting as if they don't know what's going on but they do okay manipulating the situation trying to make it seem like oh it's nothing you're gonna get over it it doesn't hurt that bad. Like, you know damn well. Excuse me. If it was the other way around, you wouldn't like somebody telling you that. Okay? So somebody is trying to make a situation seem like it's not as bad as it is, but only because they may know they have messed up a little bit. So just give the situation some time. Um... Give it some time. For in the meantime, some of you guys may need to... I'm not going to say you may need to, but maybe somebody needs to start praying a little more. And so you may be somebody that pray, but once you stop praying, you realize things go a little hectic for you. And you may realize once you start praying, things start getting a little better. You may start seeing signs and synchronicities on what to do. Revelations. And then it... What was that little crickle and crack in the door or paint? What the hell was that? But I feel like through praying, you're going to come up with some type of revelation that's going to help you in the situation. Somebody may even be asking for forgiveness from God. Okay. Uh, let's keep going. Blocks, obstacles and blocks are lifted. So again, somebody needs to just ask for forgiveness. Ask for God to help them. And I feel like you're going to get the help that you need. God is going to remove. This seems like so. But it's God going to help relieve whatever stress that you have. Okay. Um. Don't worry. Yeah, just give it. I'm, I'm here and give all your problems to God right now. All right. Whoever you are, just give all your problems to God right now. And it may sound crazy, it may sound like it's insane, but the more you stress, look, time spent worrying is time spent. So the more the time you spend worrying and stressing, the more nothing's going to get done. Nothing's going to get done when you worrying and stressing over it. Get the situation to God. Give it to God. Let God handle it. Okay. What's going on, my Capricorns? 
for some of you guys, I seen do the work. For some of you guys, work is going to help you keep your mind off this situation. Because now I feel like this reading is about to fly by. And what the fuck was that that flew by? Maybe that was an orb, but I, I seen like the hell end of the light. Like, okay, anyway. High honor, journey. Okay, so... Yeah, you don't, don't, there's nothing for you to worry about. There's really nothing for you to worry about. You could be thinking of your journey. You're somebody of high honor. Okay, you want to continue to be looked at as somebody of high honor. And it could have been something that steered you off your journey, off your path. It could have even been something that happened that you feel like is going to take away your high honor. The way people perceive you or watch, look at you, possibly from the community, because this high honor comes from the community, right? These people are built up from people. These are people from the community that come that is has your back. So now somebody is wondering, whatever did they did, did it throw me off my path? Did it throw me off my journey? Did it take away from my high honor? Did it take away from my status? House in reverse, and it could be dealing with a house, a living situation, or your stability could be off balance, or somebody. It could be some family situation going on, something going on though. Courthouse. It could be a court situation. Somebody could be fearing. You could have got some in some type of legal dealings or family disruptions, uh, relationship disruptions, arguments. But somebody is in fear that something. Um, it's going to take away from their high honor. As long as you be mature about the situation and you hold your... Give it, I'm going to just say it again. Give it to God. Give it to God. Somebody need a place to stay as well, too. Somebody's like in fear of their financial status right now, too. Somebody is fearing that if people know about somebody's true financial status, it's going to take away, again, from their actual public status. Everybody go through their ups and downs. This is where I try to stay as normal as possible. You get what I'm saying? I feel like the public is going to mess with you regardless. If this is this is strongly what I'm feeling. The community is going to mess with you even harder if you be real about what you go through. Especially if you be real about what you go through. Being this past year, I didn't went through the up and the down. Okay, so I, I'm I'm one person that I can't say I understand, and I already know how it could be. One minute you could have this, and you got plans, and this and that, and then the next minute you like <laughs> putting stuff together, trying to make a dollar, make five dollars, make two dollars, make it make it stretch. You understand what I'm saying? And I feel like that comes with life. Okay, of course you can sit back and we can think about everything that we should have been doing, what we should have been putting to the side, investing in, blase, blase. But right now, it's just life. It's a part of the journey that you're on. Somehow, some way, somebody needs to take whatever it is that they went through and um, profit off of it. As far as whether it's just you taking it as a lesson learned, turning this lesson into a blessing. However you're going to do that, turn this lesson into a blessing. Make something out of it. But again, give it to God. If you give the situation to God, God gonna help you. God gonna make you see the way, and that's gonna come in a totally different way for everybody. Somehow, some way, you gonna get the answer that you need on what to do next. I don't know what it is either. So please don't. I can't give nobody. <laughs> Cause I really don't know what it is. What is this song? Potential breakup song. Mm. So did somebody get thrown out the house? This is something dealing with the house. Uh, the house is upside down. They don't have a house in order. A relationship. It, it could even be somebody could be behind the fact that somebody, you and this person are on rocky terms. Y'all not speaking with one, one another. You may not be living in the house right now. Something, I don't know. But Knight of Wands in reverse and Four of Swords. So somebody's taking a break and somebody's taking a rest because okay, it could be a Scorpio in here. Somebody's resisting a transformation or an ending. It could even be over somebody's ways. Sexual ways. It could even be their temper. Somebody has a short temper. Short fuses. Somebody has some sexual ways that really can't be tamed and somebody possibly need a break from that. 
Somebody needed a break. Somebody's like trying to hide this. The fact that they need a break. You see this journey? This person is going on the journey. Somebody's like, I need some time out for myself. I need to go. I need to go for a while. Somebody don't truly want to end the situation, but at the same time, somebody's not changing. So there got to be some type of balance. Somebody's like, let me just leave for a little bit so that I can get my mind right. I can get my thoughts together. I can calm down. I can come back centered. What is this? Knight of Wands, because somebody feels like somebody is a player. They're never here to stay. They're always here for a short time, not for a long time. Somebody feels like somebody is very flighty. They're not dependable. I can't really depend on you. But somebody's like, well, let me have some time out for myself so I can get my energy back right, so I can get myself back focused, so I can take action when I need to. Somebody can also be drained as well, too. Somebody could... The Knight of Wands upright, too. This could even be somebody that has a lot of um, energy. They can get things done very fastly and quickly. But somebody's been, like, drained to the point that they're drained and they're irritated. And somebody's like, I need to, like... I need to leave for a second so I can get me back, basically. Somebody could even be juggling and trying to balance out finances. Trying to balance out this situation. They want to come up out of this mental entrapment that they're in. So they may not be... Somebody's not speaking up about the financial status that they're in. Somebody is not doing so well right now with this King of Pentacles in reverse. But they're having a hard time. They don't want people to know about this. So somebody don't want people to know about... Again, they're them not doing too well when it comes to finances. I know the reason why I said what I said. Somebody's like trying to hide this from their partner or the world. They're not do That they're not doing too well. They feel like if it gets exposed, again, if it's going to take away from their high honor. Somebody feels like, hey, this is you. You could have got, gained a lot of status or recognition from you being this wealthy person or a stable person or having a nice thing or finer things. Somebody is big on their reputation. <laughs> Four of swords in reverse. This shit is mirroring in one another. To the point that now somebody is like having... It's becoming stressed. It's becoming a burden. It's creating fights and arguments with this five of wands. Somebody is now becoming in competition, competitive over things. Um, somebody could even be arguing because somebody has a lot of suitors. And somebody sees that. And somebody could be... This other person could be focused on their health. Like, no, I don't want you to try to bring me nothing back. You got all these other options. But you see how it's mirroring one another? So somebody is like, I need to get it together because I'm stressed out. Time, be, time spent worrying is time spent. Somebody could be spending a lot of time in their head. Somebody's trying to finish up a cycle, but they really don't know how. Somebody wants to leave, but at the same time, they don't know how. King of Swords in reverse. Lying to themselves, not telling the truth. It was a missed opportunity or loss of money. So somebody also, if somebody feels like they'd rather leave than to tell somebody. Somebody trying to hide the fact that they lost out on a lot of money or lost out on an opportunity. Somebody be having a hard time expressing or telling so instead they're, somebody's running away from their problems. Somebody doesn't know how to express this. Somebody could have been spending a lot of money too on sexual activities or gambling, hanging out. Doing things excessively. Spending on things that they really don't need to have fun. A lot of fun. With homies, friends, and other people. It could be women. It could be men. But three of cups. See, this is partying. This could be friends or family. This could be the homies, the bros. This could even be partying. This could even be reconciliations. It could even be third party activities. However y'all want to take it. Whatever. But let's keep going. Fuck where your hoes at and where your bros at. Where your backbone, nigga. Where your cold at. 
okay? Somebody, somebody can see that they're over trying to have bros and hoes and all this other stuff. It just got them nowhere. It got them into a lot of trouble. Got them in some debt. We got missing you, and then we got authorities. So this could be your parents that's missing you. Your job could even be missing you. And then when we also think of authority, we think of authority like a, a boss or a, it could even be a police. Kind of like the emperor card. A boss or it could be like a police or something. Somebody could work in a legal system. The justice system. Reciprocal give and take. Stand your ground. Open your eyes. So all of this is, is over the reciprocal give and take. Being fair, being balanced. Somebody wasn't being fair. They was not being balanced in the situation. Okay, if somebody needs to see that, open your eyes. Stand your ground. Somebody's dealing with somebody that's not balanced. Okay, they overindulge. Whatever it is, whether it be overspending, over partying. They do things excessively. Excessively. Somebody wants a rebirth with somebody, but they don't really know how to say it. They don't know how to go about it. But somebody for sure is missing somebody. Yeah, somebody wants somebody to leave the path behind and accept them back. This is what I'm hearing. <laughs> What's going on? We got obsessive stalker. Something's hidden. Right when that came out, I looked because I felt like somebody was watching me. But nobody watching me. But I felt like it. That's the weird part. But somebody, it was something hidden, whether it be an undercover lover, secret enemy, hidden information, hidden tracking device, camera, or it could even be a possibly an undercover cop. But somebody is obsessive. They do things obsessive, overly. Somebody could even be a stalker. Somebody could even be selfish. Everything that I just said. So somebody sees that somebody somebody is like you do things excessively and you go to, you do things overboard and somebody else is like well I'm trying to I'm trying to heal I'm trying to stop I'm trying to get it together what the fuck is this start now they want your life vacation abuse the world evidence I need you lying about their sexuality then we got Gemini we got relocating. New lover, illusion, seeing things. And then we got Libra. Okay, so for some of you guys could have Libra and Gemini in your chart. Or you're in a situation, you were in a situation with a Libra and moving on to a Gemini. Or you was in a situation with a Gemini and moving on to a Libra. But there's for sure a new lover in this mix. And somebody may be high in the fact that they're moving on to somebody else. Because somebody else doesn't want to end this situation. Or maybe this is you not wanting to fully end another situation with somebody else. Because the public may know you being with this person. Maybe you guys have created some type of image together and it may not look so good if you moving on to somebody else. I don't know. Or maybe you just want your cake and you want your other cake and you just want to eat both cakes. I really don't know what's going on. For some of you guys, you feel like this other person does things obsessively. They're always talking about things. They have an illusion. They be seeing things. You can't basically say like you're crazy, you're insane, you don't know what you're talking about. But yet somebody else has evidence on somebody um, okay, so there could be, this is the thing, with that Knight of Wands in reverse and the Four of Swords in reverse, there could be an argument going on. Somebody could be trying to expose somebody's sexuality in abusive ways, especially with this evidence. And they could be blackmailing somebody to stay with them. Somebody could only be staying with somebody because they have evidence of some things that they don't want to get out to the public. They feel like it's going to ruin their reputation. And it's about who they've been sleeping with, who they've been dealing with in their aggressive ways. Okay. Yeah. But I feel like... I don't know what this is. Uh, I wanted to say, don't nobody care about nobody, but you care about this. You feel like this is your reputation on the line. Somebody's like really don't want somebody to. Somebody's like don't. So you, somebody's staying with somebody just so that they can keep their secrets hidden, basically. 
or for some of you guys, you have evidence on this person lying about their sexuality, being abusive, being a stalker. And somebody could be living in fear as well, too, because they know about their, because of this lover's past, not past, their doings behind closed doors, their abusive ways and their sexuality. Somebody may not even want to be with this person anymore, but they're in fear, don't really know how to go. Mm. It's a couple of different stories. Somebody's going to be relocating, though. Somebody's going to find the courage to relocate or get away. But there's also, like, there's somebody in this mix that's trying to black some, blackmail somebody with these evidence and with these receipts on staying with them. But little do they know, because they, they can even be saying, like, nobody else is going to want you, deal with you. That's why I say what I said, like, so you got, because it's clearly a new lover here. It's clearly somebody else that wants them. But does this, but this person could be like, do this new lover know? what you really like and who, how, and how you really are that you're abusive and you might you might be bisexual so, fuck it some of you guys might not even call it bisexual but you like what you like when you like it whatever you get what i'm saying i don't know but somebody's gonna hold something against somebody to stay i love you guys so much take care capricorns